Did you know the food we eat today is entirely different than what our grandparents had? Since man landed on the moon, the nutritional quality of our food has declined faster than gas prices during an election year. In the last 30 years, carrots have lost 27% of their calcium and iron. Broccoli has lost over 50% of its calcium and the vitamin A levels have decreased 38%. Cauliflowers lost 60% of its iron. Our beloved tomato has less phosphorus, calcium, protein, riboflavin, and vitamin C. Honestly, I could go on and on. I could explain every natural phenomenon because this is happening to nearly every food you eat. When things go downhill, people like to point fingers and naturally they're gonna point them at farmers, which may be fair, they are partly to blame, but it's not entirely the farmer's fault. The problem is we as a society are prioritizing quantity over quality because you can't really see a nutritional difference here and there's not really a good enough way to make extra money from this compared to these, so of course farmers are prioritizing yield. I'm just a little nobody vegetable farmer here in Nebraska, so I don't have all the answers, but in the next video, we're gonna talk about some of the ways that farmers and consumers can maybe help the problem.